Hey everybody, it's Sherry from The Crafty Decorator. I hope you're having an amazing day. It is raining and cold and windy here today. Listen, I am working on my dining room. I feel like I'm echoing. I'm working on my dining room and I wanted to add a little bit more fall uh, to my table. I just felt like all my chairs being this whitewash color was kind of blah. I was kind of blah. So here's what I'm going to do. I got these cute little uh, eucalyptus wreaths at Hobby Lobby for $6. They're regular 10, they're 40 off. I am going to take orange ribbon. I'm going to take orange ribbon and I am going to add this wreath to the backs of my chairs. I just love the look of it. And I think I'm gonna do them for Christmas too. So I'm gonna tell you, slide your wreath. I kind of pick which way I want it to hang, like probably that way, because some sides look better than others. Slide your ribbon through. Put it around your chair, the top of your chair here. And Figure out where you want it to hang. And you want to make sure that you get all of them even. i got to fix my ribbon here. I want to make sure I get them all even. So, like, I kind of have the top of the back of my wreath here at this middle, this second bar piece of wood going across the back. Then I cut it. I already have one cut because I cut them all at the same time. I would cut it, leave yourself a little bit because we're going to staple the ends together. So leave yourself a little bit. So here's my piece. Once I got the length that I wanted, I cut enough of the strips to go on each of my chairs. So let's put this through. I overlap, it's probably just like a quarter inch. I just gotta make sure they're all hanging the same height. Then I get my stapler. <laughs> I'm gonna try to hold it and get my stapler. I get my stapler and I staple my ends here. Can you see this? <laughs> I staple the two ends together. They're overlapping just a little bit. And then I staple the other side. And I also put one in the center, just to give it a little bit more support. I don't know if you can really there, now you can see them. The staple's going across here. Then I slide my staple end down into the wreath. Okay, I said, how am I gonna keep these from sliding all over the place on my chairs? I am using these little Velcro dots. I'm gonna Velcro these to my chair. So I'm just going to take two Velcro dots. I kind of put them together. And then I apply them to the back, like on this front side, like where the person's going to be sitting. And make sure you got them in the center there. And I press down. Now that's gonna keep my ribbon from sliding back and forth on my chairs. Okay, let me, how pretty does this look? And then I'll just like fluff up. I think it's so pretty. Now you could do a bow. You don't have to do a wreath. You could do a, a beautiful bow on the back, but I'm kind of really loving them. No, I did not show you my table setting yet. I got to wash everything now. I kind of wanted to see how I wanted it. 
and I got to wash everything. And then I will show you my table setting, guys. If you like my shirt, because I know a lot of you say, where are you getting your shirt? I got this at Cracker Barrel. <laughs> okay. Thanks for joining me. Bye.